record recording in progress okay um o hiru as i o hiru ma no bansan kai okay so um we did see this before i'm pretty sure but Hi. i forgot what it was i think it's a, a very well, large space yes that's exactly what it means mm, yeah uh, basically like a large room yeah o hiru ma and then the bit... bansan kai bansan kai uh yeah, I, I'm pretty sure we saw this, but I guess it's been like a week and um, mm -hmm. it's not like Anki where we do this every day so, and so. then it becomes like three days later. <laughs> so, um, yep. So, Kai basically kind of normally means like assembly or something like that. Yeah, but that together, makes sense. This means banquet. So, like a banquet is like a big eating hall, basically, like mm -hmm. event. That makes sense. So, so it's all the. Big eating hall, the banquet in the large room, basically. Mm -hmm. So how are we going to distribute these uh, phrases here? This one is pretty long, up to here. Yeah, sounds like I should probably do that. Yeah, okay. I too, boy, did yo, kyaku wa butu butu ii nagara, hon ya noto yukku ni oshikomu to jibun mo hashi ni mukatte hashite ita. So the I too is basically saying like that person, and this is referring to Annie from last week. They're saying you'll remember this, Annie. This is this is what you say when you're really mad at somebody. <laughs> you'll remember this. You'll re basically it's like a way of saying you'll regret this in Japanese. It's oboiteru, which means to memorize. So you'll yeah. remember this. You'll regret this. So Jack he says this while um being very like grumpy, butu butu. It's kind of like a grumbly like rah, rah, kind yeah. of um talking and he goes over and stuffs his um book uh, notebook and he puts them inside of his backpack he just stuffs them into her. and then he turns toward the bridge himself and begins to run toward it <laughs> okay uh interesting okay i'll go next uh dare mo mitsukarimasen yo ni Okay, so so that means nobody. Yep. Yeah, so and then and then it's like nobody um mitsukari masen. I feel like this is something to do with found or something. Yes. And it's in yeah. negative form. Yeah, so, so didn't find. So nobody to find me. But then we have yo ni. You know what that's doing there? I, I feel like yo is like a form, like a manner, a way of doing. It can be. Um, yo ni has many meanings, um, depending on the context. Um, for example, one of the meanings could be similes. In this context, though, this means basically in order to. So in order to for no one to be able to find me, um, what he did was inoru. He prayed. So so, uh, you might click the hokan nakata. I believe that means there was nothing else he could do, but I'm not a hundred percent on that. Wait, hokan. Uh, yep. Oh, so can do. Yeah, so it's like nothing you can't but. do anything but pray. Yep, and it makes sense because nakata is nai, as in, you know, aru is to have, nai is to not have, and hoka is as in others, like hokano, like hokano hito, tani. Yeah, that's right. So uh, there's like hoka and there's betsu. Um, I think betsu refers to like physical objects. Hoka means like doing something different. I don't know. Uh, but I'm, the betsu is very like, hmm. Hokano kind of like almost like includes yourself in with mm -hmm. the thing. Well, Betsu more is just like saying different as in like the word different. Like Hokano kind of has a has a like a relationship almost, but I don't think it really it's probably like basically the same. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll have to like see more examples of it to really get the gist of it, but we'll see. So excuse me, uh Okay, I'll do the next one and then I'll let you do the Sounds next good. one because that one's next long. Okay. Atari ga dandan kurakunatte kita. So it's like um 
Atari, we saw this a few times. We um, did. Yeah. Um, kind of like saying Suri or um, like Chikai almost. Chikai Tokoro is Atari. Chikai Tokoro. So like nearby? Yes. Atari yeah. is nearby around or the surroundings in this context. So nearby, um, Danda, I think means. Yeah, so nearby it was getting darker, wasn't it? Yep. That's exactly yeah. what it's saying. Yep, it became the surroundings of getting darker and darker. Step and by this step. is like um, this bit all the way is like uh to become like it's conjugated, yes. yeah. So yep, wonderful. Naru became not the kita. Um, so ka kiri de wakara na kat wakara na katta kedo koko koko wa ima yuga. Tanan. <laughs> I don't know. That was hard for me to read. Um, yeah. So he's saying, "Oh, so um, I wasn't able to understand because of the the mist. However, right now it must be evening. Um, so yeah, here's you got the evening when there's like the when they have the kanji gone. <laughs> it's like so confusing. Yeah. <laughs> so very weird. Uh, yeah. So yeah, it's like so, and that and uh, is just the explanation and uh, being like, oh." Oh, that's that's why it's becoming darker and darker because it's evening oh that's right and, and we thought this was a book that was like you're just in one situation and it's isolated from time space everything <laughs> well that's pretty scary um <laughs> okay um next part um, oto o tateta. Okay, so the sound um, is actually gishi gishi. Sounds like gishi, grinding. Gishi. Yeah. You know what a hanebashi is? That was a word we saw last week. It's a type of hashi. Drawbridge, and I yeah. can distinctly remember that because I just somehow did. Okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a drawbridge. Um. So the wooden drawbridge. Um. And then it's like. Wataru, um, we did see this. I know we did see that. Um, I think so. It means wataru to... normally means to cross, but yep, I would have guessed that. Uh, it's kind of weird in this context. I guess it's saying while Jack is crossing, it makes yeah. a geeky noise because <laughs> tatete is the noise it makes, but it, it is kind of weird. Yeah, we. Uh, I'm just gonna go. Um, I might get you. Maybe click wataru. Me. Yeah, see what's what. <laughs> They're like, not buy it. <laughs> That's oh my God. That's the first thing that pops up. What that Come is? On. They're like, not buy it, not buy it. Perhaps this is the not buy it. This is not helpful. This is not helpful at all. F in the chat. That is that is some very unhelpful. What that is. <laughs> Jeebus creepers. Um. Okay. What about this? Yeah. So it makes a scree a creak, squeak, and creaking sound, or um. Right grinding as i said over here but that's fine um just, i just did that just to make sure i forgot i have yomi chan powers now okay <laughs> <laughs> so, probably doesn't work for what that is though <laughs> no that that's not very powerful okay uh, so we're gonna so i think um i, I think I'm, I'm gonna for now assume like um it's cr they they try to cross the bridge and then it made that uh creaking sound or something. Yeah, like you're stepping on a crank uh wood. You're like, oops. Maybe we should go that to one. your um that website where we can ask uh, very short questions on uh. So, um, yeah. I could I'd be better probably just to Google what that do and see what pops up. But yeah. I'm gonna do my line next, and you could get to do the next one even though it's very long. That's fine. Um, Jack wa hashi no shita no ohori wo nozoite mita. So Jack tries poking into the the moat around that is below the bridge. And then you're going to see and your line is describing what he sees. Honto ni uh wa ni wait wa ni ga iru no ka um tashi kame yo tome o Okay, so um So you I wanna first one... start? Yeah. So I believe uh one knee was a crocodile. Um, it was. Yeah, so 
So it's like there really were crocodiles down there. However, we do have this cop. Yeah, however. Which makes this into a better, this makes it to an embedded question to cop, Yoku wo kara nai. Mm-hmm. Uh, but it's like, tashi... Oh, wait, don't think about that for now. Okay. Yeah, no, um, right. It's like, yoku wa nai. It's like, um, I didn't know very well. Yeah. Whether or not, that's the no ka, kani ga iru. Mm-hmm. So what does it mean? So it's like the it seems like there were really crocodiles down there, but I didn't really know for sure. Close. Um, it's directly what it's saying. Whether or not they were really crocodiles over there, I don't really know. Fair enough. So yeah. he really has no idea. And the other line is basically saying why he doesn't know. Ta tashikame yo to me o korashita ga kurakute. It was too dark. So, so. Um, it was too dark. What did he do, though, to... Do you know what tashikameru means? Uh, I'm not sure, but I'm going to guess that we have seen it before. Probably. It's a pretty common word in Japanese. It basically means to, like, double-check, like, the make sure of something. Yeah, I've yomi chan uh, powers. <laughs> yes. So, ta, 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 tashika... Ta, 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 Tashikameru. Check to make sure. Yeah, that's right. That makes sense. Now I can see the kanji and I'm like, yep, that completely makes sense now. <laughs> Hi. Um, and then you have the yoto. Do you remember what yoto to told us? Tashikame uh, yoto. Like, um, it, it's not the same yo as the one we saw like previously around here, right? Yeah, a very different. Yeah. So in, in the end, um, I'll have to ask you on that one, or maybe use my Yomi-chan powers. Yoto. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, Yoto <laughs> is like grammar. I don't think your Yomi-chan has grammar on it. Damn it. Uh, it means he goes to try to do something. So it's kind of that old tosuru we've seen before, where you attempt to do something, but you don't actually succeed in doing it. Um, oh, so he's yeah. trying to double check. However, when he mail korases, it's kurai. Yeah, that's right. So it's too dark for him to see what's really in the moat. So, so. Um, do you know what mail korasu means? Um, hmm. To gaze or peek? Good guess. It peek? actually means to squint. To squint your eyes. Oh, Specifically, yeah. korasu means like to strain. So he's straining by squinting his eyes. Yeah. So all together says whether or not there were actually um, alligators. In order to, to check this, I squinted my eyes. However, it was too dark, so I couldn't really know. I have no idea. That's right. That sounds pretty good. Okay. Um, then we have Soro Tokida, which is it was that time. Yep. So it was that time. Uh, let me just go ahead and there we go. Okay. Um, Razor, come on, get rid of all the marks. Thank you. Draw. Um, oh, wait, not that mark. This one's important. Okay. Um, where should I go up to here? I can do this. I think that seems good. Yeah. Okay. Toko ni dare ka iru no ka. I said that a bit weird, but that's fine. Jo heki no ue kara miwari mihari no. Um, so it's like over there, there's like somebody over there. Who's saying that, do you think? Um, probably Jack, because there's no... Nope. Oh, it's Annie. You would guess. Uh, no koe. So a lot of time. so that right there is the said blank, basically. So Jack hears Kikoitad Sokoni Dare ga iru ka. <laughs> so Mihari, you could probably uh -huh. guess we have me in there from watching. So Mihari like basically is the it's the guard, basically the watchman, it should be. Okay, mm -hmm. you can click at the see what the second kanji is. Mihari. It's a stand guard. Yeah, it's stand watch. So um, the lookout. So it's right. the voice of a lookout. Not and where this is this lookout standing, do you think? Um, Joheki, so the castle, on top of the castle walls. 
Yes, yeah, specifically the, the 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 moat walls, the, the the like it's the castle walls. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> uh, okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, wait. Where did I go too far? Okay, I fixed yeah, you're it. Just, you're just you're just flowing all over. <laughs> okay. Hi. Um, Jack wa tobi agatte oi sogi de hashi o watari mono kugutta. So Jack basically begins running. That's the tobi agatte means like normally means like the fly up, but it is it's using that metaphorically. And in a big rush, rush he crosses the bridge and gets go underneath the the gate. That makes sense. So he sense. gets through it into the castle. Mm-hmm. And then, so ko wa koishi o shikitsumeta nakani wa datta. Okay, so once again over there, there's、Hi. like a small stone, and then it's like, or,、oh, and then it just follows through, I believe.、Um, well, I'm not sure what shikitsumeta means, but. Nakaniwa is like an inner garden, like the garden somewhere. To cover so, a surface. So it's saying that the rocks are covering the surface of the inner garden. So it's like、oh, um、yeah. the courtyard. So over there, there was. So this is what he saw. So ko koichi would be like gravel. Yeah. So this is what um. Annie saw, I guess, when they went into well, the. Well, Jack no, sorry. saw. Jack saw. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, because it... Annie is gone. We don't know where Annie is. She ran into the castle way earlier. Jack saw by himself. Yeah. Okay.、Uh, wonderful. Um, and there's like, okay, I think that's pretty good. And then,、yep. I think we should alternate from here. Sounds good. Oshiro no naka kara ongaku ya warai goe ga hikoite kuru. So from the castle, the sounds of music and laughing, laughter, Jack could basically hear that. It, it, the sound would come to him. Yeah, or he was able to hear it. Keep going.、Right. Um, okay. Well, it、uh, came. Sorry. The the kudo is like the coming toward him part. He was、yeah. able to hear it coming toward him.、Mm-hmm. The sound. Okay. Ah,、uh, Jack wa ah、uh, mono kage ni kakurete. Ani o sagashita. So it's like um.、Mm, so Jack was like mono kake ni ah.、Uh, so you know what kage means? That's the normal word. A shadow. Yes. So、yeah. mono kage is the, a shadow of something.、Basically. Oh wow. Okay. Um. So kakurete. Um. I just I just want to check with you. What does kakurete mean? You know kakurembo. That's a game kids love to play. Never、kakurembo. heard of it. I'm sorry. Oh, kakurembo is hide and seek. So kakureru is to hide. So Jack hides in what? Ah,、uh, the shadow of something.、Oh. Yeah. Yeah. So he hides in the shadows pretty much, and then he found Annie. Did he find it? Oh, and and blah, blah, blah. and then he's like looking for Annie, right? Yes, and then he、yeah. looks for Annie. Yep. So、yeah. it probably would say mitsukata if she found her. Sagasu is just the act of looking. Yeah. E- even then, I doubt Jack. I I doubt Jack is gonna find Annie this quickly. He's probably gonna hear her screaming, and then he's like, "Oh, there's Annie." <laughs> oh no! I don't want to、um, get thrown in jail. Okay. Um. Taimatsu no Taimatsu no Akari ga mawari no. Johekio terashite ru. So the light of a taimatsu. Not sure what that is, but it is basically lighting up the walls that's surrounding them. So I would almost guess like oil lamps or something. But you might click taimatsu. Kerosene lamps. Did they used to have kerosene lamps? I'm gonna quickly check. Kerosene lamps. So, but which one was it? Taimatsu. It's the first word on there. That's the. Right. That's what they're making light. Yeah, torch. Torch, torch lights. Yeah, it wouldn't make sense for、Bamboo. them to have kerosene lamps. It's too old. So so. So yeah, um. So, did we say what the sentence was? Yep, the sentence is that those lights, the 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 torch lights, are basically lighting up the 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 walls、mm-hmm. that um 
they're kind of like around the walls. The mawari is like the mawari no. So the, the walls are going around them, all have the lights. And that's what's lighting them up. Right, I see. Okay. Um, next part. I think I will take these two sentences over here because Sounds this one is a bit too short. Okay. Hizume, yeah, Hizume no oto ga kikoete kita, uh, shonen ga uma o hi, hi te arute kuru. Okay, so it's like, um, Hizume. Uh, I'm. I think that's referring to something, but it's the sounds of it is. this hizume. Um, have yep. we talked about this? I doubt it. I don't know. It could be a, like the horse whine, but probably not. I feel like that's like a different noise. Uh, hoof. Hoof. that makes yeah. logical sense. Hoof. Okay. Since the shonen is hite arukuing uma, so hoof yeah, makes so, logical sense. So Jack, at this point, he is able to hear the sounds of hooves, and then. Hey. Shonenga. Um, I think this is like a bo- boy. Yes, I, 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 a boy. Okay. A yeah. young man, a boy. Yeah, and then it's like umao hite arukite aruite. So it's like a young man is like walking his horse, right? Or pulling his horse yes. or not. Yep. And the kuru is just telling us that he's entering the scene now. Jack can now see him basically. Aruite oh, kuru. coming okay. toward Jack. Yeah. Um, Umagoya et Tsurete uh, Irash I Tsurete Ikurashi. So it seems like it's bringing um, the horse to the horse house. Um, and then Yokumiruto Saki no Kishi no Kuroi Umodatta, which when I look at it, like give it a good look, I can now know that that's definitely the horse that was the black horse that we saw that night on earlier today. Mm-hmm. And then I'll go next. Yeah. Right. Uh, Jack wa mo ichido me o korashite kurayami o mitsumeta. Okay, so mo, I think in this context, means already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not really. So mo ichido is kind of almost a sad Once again. phrase. Yes. Yeah, so mo ichido once again. Me o korashite. Um, so he squinted. Hi. Yeah, and then urayami o mitsumeta. Um, I think this means darkness or something like yep. that. Yeah. So yep, it is dark. darkness, the noun. Yeah, and then mitsumeta. Um, so ooh, <laughs> there's a lot so, of different ways to say that. Yeah, so mitsuketa is to find, mitsumeru is to stare at. Oh, so he's staring into the darkness. Okay. Hi. Wonderful. And uh, I'm just going to, oh God, I need to like somehow mark this. <laughs> <laughs> so I need to like not lose track of the that full stop. Okay. So I, I have my eye on the full stop. It's the anigaita. Um, yep. So. Now I can remove everything else. I'm so sorry. I guess it's because I'm not used to reading like top to bottom, right to left. Um, it's 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 very hard to keep track when you scoot through word with things. That's actually part of the reason why I like doing the page flip version because it keeps track for you. Yeah, it <laughs> versus does. Versus the tap 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 version because that's actually confusing. There's actually a setting to set in there that makes it that it doesn't cut off sentences. Mm-hmm. so that's that's what i've started doing but then my computer died so i didn't get to use that very long no um, okay <laughs> annie gaita there's it oh annie's over there mm-hmm. over specifically annie's here um naka ni wa no man naka ni aru ido no kage kara te o futte iru so right um in the center of the courtyard there is a well that um has a shadow that it's, it's casting and in that shadow there's a hand waving hmm interesting okay <laughs> i hope annie hasn't fallen into that well um, <laughs><笑> Kake yota. 
Okay, I had a brain fart, but that's fine. So, what in the world? So, yep. so remember, this right here, this is in short form. So, that means this is a relative clause, which means this is describing the shonen. So, so this we is have the, a shonen. So, it's the guy who's pulling the horse along. Yes. Yeah. He, so Jack is matte doing. Jack is matte doing. for the guy to pass. Yes. Specifically yeah. to disappear. Nakunata to disappear. Yeah. Oh my god. That's true. Now that you say it, it makes sense. <laughs> uh, uh, once he disappears, he, what's his plan? Uh, oh, what, what, what did he do? So it's like, Ani no tokoro e kake yo. Um, I think so. He wants to go to Annie's place, but I'm not yes. sure exactly what this means. Kake yo, so also this, run over. Yes, it is to run over. So kake is a very common word compound to mean to rush, and yoru mm -hmm. is another very common word compound to mean to get closer to. So together, it's to rush over. Yeah, that's right. That's really cool. Okay, um, and I think I can give this dialogue to you. Seems good. Um, so the I want to go try looking for where that music is coming from. Big brother, do you want to come as well? And then I'm gonna do what Annie said, which is Annie ga sasayaita, which means Annie whispered. Which wasn't in your mark, but might as well flow that with it. That's fine. And then you get to see what does Jack say? Uh, so, uh, okay, so it's like, this is a verb, so I don't think this means, um, oh my so god. So this is, so this isn't a verb, we have dame. Sorry. Oh yeah, sorry, dame. <laughs> So we have dame. What does dame mean? No good. Yep. And then we have te you. Like that's right? not it's like don't say that or something. That's a good guess. Um, and, and it depends on the context. Te you mm -hmm. just means to say. However, in this context, he's saying he's basically referring to himself. The mm -hmm. temo. You know what temo adds to stuff? Yeah, it temo. would. Um I'm just trying to think. Uh Like I can I can feel it like very faintly in my head, but I can't put the it words. It basically together. means even if, even if yeah, this occurs, that makes so, sense. So damete itemo means even if I said no. So this is right here is a perfect example of showing how temo doesn't mean he necessarily does the verb. He doesn't say no because the whole entire point of this rhetorical question is that even if I said no, Annie's going to do se ikundaro. Is like uh, <laughs> she's just going to go there. Yeah, anyway. you're just gonna go anyway. <laughs> so because of that, isho ni iku shikanai janai ka. And do you remember what shikanai means? Saw that before, I think. Yes, we did. Um it's basically so, the opposite so of dake. Do you know what dake means? Dake. Um Look, I'm so sorry. We've gone through this multiple times. I just need more time what? to like That's go how over it and make mistakes. Shika is officially a like N three vocab word, I think, rather than like an N five vocab word. Like the it's not it's not like dake. Dake is like the N five version. So dake means like um only and shika means except for. So shika and I, they're just telling it means no choice, which it does yeah. mean that. Um, in this specific context, but that's not the grammar. She goes, except for ikuing, there's nothing. Is what it yeah. says. So having no choice is what it means if you wanted to like not. <laughs> if you yeah. want to learn it as a, as like a word rather than what it actually is, which is mm. nai like to not exist, like not auto, auto becomes nai and she goes, and except for ikuing, there's nothing. Yeah. Um, the the only instance I've ever really thought of uh, shika is when it's called a moose. I've seen oh, you mean, play... you mean you don't mean a moose, you mean um a deer. <laughs> yeah, a deer. That's right. So it's like um I I saw like a show where they two kids were playing the sort of word game. So it's like they went shika like this, 
and then the next person went kamemoshi. Hi, that's called shiritori. Yeah, shiritori. And then they got stuck in a loop. They just went shika kamemoshi, shika kamemoshi. <laughs> I think that's not allowed. I think you're not allowed to repeat words, but <laughs> kids can just, play however they want. They just did it anyway. And then, yep. <laughs> so I have no choice but to go with you, right? Or something. Yeah, like, don't I have no choice at all but to go with you? Like, yeah. He's basically saying, what, what is even the point in asking me if you're not going to listen? Yeah. Okay, and uh, next part. Um... Uh, futari wa naka ni wo shinobi ashi de susumi ishizukuri no tatemono no naka ni suberi konda. So this is saying that the two of them, they, mm -hmm. um, they continue it through the... Um, the courtyard with quiet feet like feet like ninjas is how i like to think about it mm -hmm. um and they slip inside of the building that is made out of um stone so mm -hmm. like the castle basically yeah. that's what that is okay so um we're gonna read one more sentence over here or yeah we'll, we'll um we're going to stop over here, which I'm going to do this part, and then we're going to quickly switch meeting rooms. Sounds good to me. Yeah, okay. So, naka wa totemo kurakata. So that means uh, inside was really dark. Yep. <laughs> yep, and uh, really, okay. Really dark. Yeah, really dark. Okay, so <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and um, uh, I think it's stop sharing and then end the meeting yep. and then we'll just quickly try and get back into this meeting. Hopefully that will work. Sounds good. Um, oh, it okay. depends on how you shared it, but...